So in this video, we need to find the least possible integer n such that 2 to the n is greater than 50 to the power of 132. Now, this number is obviously very, very large indeed. Uh, so large, in fact, that my calculator cannot deal with it. So I can't do this by trial and improvement, unfortunately. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use logarithms and I'm going to take the natural log of both sides. Okay, so taking the natural log of both sides, I'm going to get the natural log of 2 to the n is greater than the natural log of 50 to the 132. Now you might be wondering, well, why have I taken the natural log? Why have I not taken the, nat the log base 2 or log base 50 of both sides? Um, you could. You could do that. Um, the only thing that I would really be careful with is uh, knowing um, when you've got a negative logarithm. As we looked at in the previous video, you've got to be so careful with this um, because of it, we are working with an inequality. Multiplying dividing through by a negative number will cause a problem or will change the direction of the inequality symbol. So my recommendation is to stick with natural logs for these types of problems. Okay, It causes less issue. So um, we're going to use the power rule, bring the n down to the front. So we've got n times the natural log of 2 is greater than 132 times the natural log of 50. Then I can divide through by the natural log of 2. Now, I know that the natural log of 2 isn't negative because remember in the previous video, the value here had to be between 0 and 1 in order for it to be negative. So dividing both sides by log 2 is fine. It won't change the direction of the inequality symbol. OK, so I'm going to put that into my calculator. So 132 times the natural log of 50 uh, divided by the natural log of 2. And this is 744.989, etc. So the question asks, find the least possible integer n such that it solves that inequality. So we want the least n that will solve it. So the next integer would be 745. So n equals 745 is the least possible integer that will solve the inequality.